A local high school soccer player is preparing for a trip to Chile after being named the youngest member of the U.S. soccer men's deaf national team. Six on Your Side's Jessica Taylor introduces us to the player. 17-year-old Braden Anderson currently plays for the Boise Timbers, and he'll soon be playing in the 2019 Deaf Pan American Games. He's been playing the sport since he was a toddler, and his coach says he's definitely earned a spot on the national team. I've been playing soccer for like 15 years. Keep in mind, he's only 17, but you'll spot Braden Anderson right away on the field. What you might miss watching him hustle during the game is the device on his ear. Uh, I was just born deaf. I got my implant when I was just three years old. His coach got in touch with the deaf national team when Braden was just 16 years old. I didn't know how young they would scout players, but I wanted to get him on the radar because I knew that as a deaf player, he'd be probably one of the better players in the country. They invited him to participate in a camp and now he's the youngest player on the deaf national team and soon he's going off to Chile to play at the 2019 deaf Pan American Games. Get to play other deaf national team like uh, Argentina, Chile. It's going to be a, probably a great experience for me to go, especially I'm a young 17 year old, especially all the other guys are older than me. His coach says his progression in the sport has more than earned him a spot on the national team. You know, I've coached Braden for at least uh, probably six years or more now. He plays a critical role centrally in the field, often the most difficult position to play. So it's not just like you stick him out in a wide position where there's not as much going on. He's in the middle of the field where everything is 360 degrees around him and he has to use his eyes and the other senses he has uh, more acutely than anyone else. It's his first time leaving the country and he's hoping to come back a World Cup qualifier. A little nervous, but I'm ready to uh, go kill it right there. His next goal to play in college and then he says he'll see how he does. He has a fundraising page to help pay for his travel expenses. If you feel inclined, it's up on our website, sixonyourside.com. Reporting in studio, Jessica Taylor, Six on Your Side.